I was a student, I was actually working on this other lamp and I had this extra lampshade frame that was laying around in my apartment. And I just kept on thinking about like wrapping some cotton yarn over it. And, uh, and then I tried it with a really bad, like normal cotton. So it was kind of like really time consuming, but I kind of liked the result and then I have this company that does knitwear to use their leftovers to try to make the first actual bomb on them. I don't think about many things I had, but colors particularly, it's like in the moment. I just kind of freestyle, like as if I was like painting or drawing. My favorite thing about this product is that uh, it has like endless possibilities. The shapes, uh, the colors, so it's really easy to make something really classic and something over the top in the same production process just by changing the shape and the colorways. I always think about lamps in this way that they are around all day long, but you need light only when it gets dark. And then a lamp with the light turned off is an object, like any other object, like a sofa or like a chair. I do like that difference between the on and off. When I met Mette and Rolf some years ago, I really liked the idea of the company and like I, f I feel like it was sort of focusing on this particular niche, which was in between two different design worlds at the time. And I just felt like this was the right match to try to make this handmade thing into a handmade but produced thing that will be like available on a larger scale.